From LA Late Headquarters in Santa Monica, this is Afternoons LA Late. It's a big afternoon of Afternoons LA direct from Santa Monica with the latest update about your fourth stimulus check update of 2021. In this recording, we'll go over that monthly stimulus check that the Democrats want you to have and why they're likely to give you more months of checks. Then we cut to the recon. A done deal, signed, sealed. $3.5 trillion of checks coming to the American people under the fourth stimulus recon. And we'll go over why the Purple Hawks, the member of this channel, will do so incredibly well under this mostly application-based for stimulus recon. But then in the final 15 minutes of this video, we'll go over the IRS aid checks where you don't have to lift a finger and the push to get those in there as well. Those are the monthly stimulus checks. MSC and the number one guy in DC wants you to have them. I'll have the world exclusive in only in this recording. And then we'll go over economic and financial freedom, which is created by getting big bills paid this week. How do those bills get paid for? With third stimulus. As you're going to meet one viewer who went from $80,000 of bills paid to another $100,000 paid in less than seven days. I have all that deliciousness. As the surf is up, the stimulus is up. I'm here. You're here. It's a beautiful afternoon. And we're going to get to the news. Starting right now. Hey, good afternoon, everybody. I hope you're doing wonderful. The we weather is a little bit still hot here in Santa Monica, unfortunately. It's beautiful, sunny skies, but it's hot because September is usually hot in Santa Monica. Jump in the live chat and tell me where you're tuning in from and how the weather is where you are. So much wonderful news, so much great news, so much breaking new news in this recording today. We'll be going over that monthly stimulus check and why the Democrats are likely to give you more months of checks. We'll be going over September. <laughs> it's September. Guess what? It's a very busy legislative month. And even today, Janet Yellen sent a letter to Congress. She's your Treasury Secretary. Talking about so many things this weekend, and the, uh, the Chief of Staff to the President so, spoke about for stimulus. There's a lot of legislation going on this week, and they've been working on your recon around the clock. I'll have the latest details and the money for you in this recon. Then the world exclusive broke only on this channel about the push for those monthly stimulus checks. House versus Senate, Senate versus House. Well, this is Senate as the number one guy in the Senate wants you to have an MSC, a monthly stimulus check. And we'll go over all the deliciousness of that and more as we go into a big afternoon. And it starts right here. On Alight, America's only 24-hour day, seven days a week, financial news channel in America, live in the morning, taped in the afternoon. The biggest and the best financial news channel there is, delivering you 24 hours a day, seven days a week, financial breaking news, and getting you big sums of money since day one this channel launched, and finally, world exclusives. So subscribe. 400,000 subscribers a YouTube record. You found the best of the best. Hit that subscribe button. I want you part of this family. Like the video, two, 3,000 likes, and consider becoming a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power, or Calcino VIP. The link to become a member is under the video. Meantime, if you've not signed up for those LA alerts, please do so. You can alert when a new video goes live, and when anything breaking news happens, whether it's the eviction moratorium or major economic news. It's at news.la.com. The link is in the video. And let's get to the details of what the alerts say today. You get those alerts wherever you are. House versus Senate, Senate versus House. The Democrats want you to have an MSC. Let's go over who wants you to have what and what they're saying. They're all talking about it. When we turn to AOC at Almar. 
calling for monthly $2,000 a month, but not seeing the number of months. Then we have Warren Sanders and Wyden calling for monthly, but not seeing the number of months or the amount. We have the House Ways and Means Committee. That's the people who actually write the stimulus package. They're calling for monthly, but don't say the amount nor how many months. Americans are demanding $2,000 a month and a petition at nearly 4 million signatures but they don't say the number of months. And yet the item that's captivating a country, from the beaches of Santa Monica to the shores of the East Coast, is that House bill, pandemic plus one year, which would amount to a stimulus check for at least 12 months. That's $1,000 a month, amounting to at least $13,000. So I think you have an opinion. Jump in the live chat right now and say House or Senate, Senate or House. Tell me where you're tuning in from, what city and state, and how the weather is this beautiful afternoon's light. Who gets this forced stimulus check? You do. Democrats represent that if you got a third, you get a forced stimulus check. Single individual, 75000 or less. Democrats represent you get one. Married couple, 150000 or less. Democrats represent you get a forced stimulus check. Double it. Family of four. Democrats represent you get a forced stimulus check. Quadruple it. And if you're on benefits, SSI, SSDI, Social Security, and Railroad Benefits, the forced stimulus check would be coming to you as well. The forced stimulus check is not income. It's not taxable. And the forced stimulus check would be the same amount for everyone, including adult dependents. Finally, the forced stimulus check would come monthly. It would not come in waves. It's not a waveable check. So if you went to the beach today and the check came up and kissed you on two cheeks, uh, don't wave at it. It's just an Italian check. Kiss back. <laughs> just kiss the back. Kiss back the check. Uh, and say, come back with your friends. I need multiple checks. <laughs> the second half of this video... You'll be hearing the, actually, actually the third part of this video, you'll be hearing the world exclusive only broken on this channel. As the number one guy on the budget committee wants you to have a monthly stimulus check, MSC. He wants to hear from you. He has a proposal and it's deliciousness. It's coming up in the final 15 minutes of this video. Stay to the very end. And then you're going to also hear world breaking news about Janet Yellen talking about all the different equations of September. It's breaking news today, it's new, and it's all over the place. It's coming up in the final 15 minutes of the video. Stay to the very end. But first, let's get some money, because let's be frank here. It's the middle of the week, you need some money. Four stimulus check is not landing this week. It's not landing next week, it isn't landing last week. And you need your bills paid. Well, guess what? You found the correct place because that's what I do on this channel. I'm going to introduce you to the ability to make money, to get money, to get your bills paid, and it's a lot of it. It's called third stimulus. Yeah, you may have thought a third stimulus is just a $1,400 stimulus check, but if you just found this channel, viewers are getting upwards of $100,000 additionally for their bills paid under third stimulus. So get a pen and paper ready, ready right now because I show you how to get this big sum of money. We're going to get some rent, utilities, mortgage assistance, and homeowners utilities starting right now. And our inspiration is Johnny. Johnny got $80,000 from this channel on uh, a, uh, in less than five days. It happened two weeks ago. Two weeks ago, Johnny was one of three viewers of this channel who, by themselves, started the week at $0, and by Wednesday, by themselves, had gotten $40,000 each. Johnny got three items of 40000 but he wasn't done there. And he, he pushed and he got seven items by the weekend, getting $80,000 of items from this channel. What'd he get? More about that in a second. But the great news is that Johnny wasn't done then. The next week, he turned around and got his family and friends the, the, the focus to tune into this channel. And those family and friends, after tuning into this channel, got an additional $100,000. That's $180,000 from Johnny and his friends in less than one week. Let's go over Johnny's success story, which is yours after today, starting right now. Johnny got $12,000 for SNAP. Then he got $10,000 for EIDL. He got $2,000 for taxes. He got $21,000 for rent. Then he got another $25,000 for rent. Then he got $9,000 for utilities on top of that. And he got $50 a month for internet and phone, bringing his grand total to $80,000. He got that two weeks ago in less than five days. Then what Johnny did was he started telling his friends and family the next week about this channel. 
I just got $80,000 from Third Stimulus. Third Stimulus, I thought it was just a $1,400 stimulus check, his family member said. No, no, no. There's a lot of other money in there. You have to pick up the phone. What do you mean, pick up the phone? I'm not used to picking up the phone. Of course you pick up the phone. You just ordered some pizza. <clears throat> you always pick up the phone. Uh, well, what do I get if I pick up the phone? Money. Really? And this is what Johnny says. I've been talking to you about talking about you to my friends and family. And as of today, I helped five friends save their home in less than five days. Five friends saved their home because they were watching this channel in less than five days and put food on my table and three family members thought I was full of it. So they saw your channel and then they thought, wow, this is a snap and oh my God. Two family members got $41,500 and the other got $57,600. $100,000 he got his friends and family in less than one week. This has been awesome to see people stop stressing about bills. Your channel's helped so many others and myself tremendously. You are such a godsend. Purple power, purple hawks. Let's go over the big sum of money that you're able to get right now. And what I want to make very clear, which I haven't made clear in a while, is the following. For you to get right now, this is not a channel where you sort of find a person to do work for you. Mm -mm. Johnny picked up the phone and got the money for himself. Seven items, 80000 He told his friends and neighbors about it. They picked up the phone and they got the items. I reached out to the community volunteers a few day, the, in the last 24 hours, and they report that nearly 100% people reach, 100 of the people reach out to them on the community page have not tried to get any of this money themselves and have asked the volunteers to do all the work for them. Mm -mm, you ain't going to do that here. You're going to get this money yourself. This is money for you. So pick up the pen and paper because you're going to do it right now. He, let's turn to that rent that you can get right now. You can reach out to six places to get this money. But first, let's go over the money and the calculations before we go over how to do it. The money is astronomical. Let's look at the rent that viewers are getting. They're getting over $20,000. Look at that. Elizabeth, $27,000 for rent. And then when we talk about utilities, incredible. $9,000 Johnny got for utilities. The number is going bigger. Why? Because viewers are getting more sophisticated and are more knowledgeable. The largest channel grows. So this is getting bigger and bolder. Then SNAP, which is money for food from Department of Agriculture. I'm going to go over in a second. You're going to see someone who got even higher than this and is heading to 25000 And then the people who got three items like Nisi, Mark, and uh, Nisi, and Nancy, 32000 and 23000 But then there's Mark, who got two items at 32000 Let me tell you about Mark. I have two updates. The second one I'm going to reveal to you later this week. But here's the first update. Mark got two items on himself, picking up the phone, and got two items of 32000 rent and utilities. But for five days on camera, I told Mark to get the third item, which is SNAP. It's money for food from Department of Agriculture. He got it. That's a great success story, number one. Number two, he reports back that he said, I'm not going to stop with three items. I'm going to get more. Johnny inspired him. Number three, Mark uh, told his neighbor about this channel, and the neighbor watched this channel, and the neighbor on his own accord, not using the volunteers, but doing himself, picked up the phone and got $20,000 for rent. If that sounds unusual in less than five days, it's not. Because Shanann, a purple hawk of two months, told her friend about this channel as well. And Shanann reports that her friend in less than five days got $21,000 for three items, rent, utilities, food, and internet. I told my friend about you, and now she's addicted. That's what's important is the is Shanann didn't do the money for her friend, and the friend didn't have the community page do it for her. The friend picked up the phone and got rent, utilities, and food. Three different items, three different phone calls, $21,000. Congratulations. And then finally, Mark got that money for SNAP. How much money did Mark get for SNAP? He got $19,000, bringing his grand total on this channel, Mark, to $50,500. But the sky's the limit on this channel, because let me introduce you to Lorraine, who on her own accord got over $105,000 from this channel. And this is what we do, because this is allied. We've been doing it since day one. In spring of last year, I showed people how to get their applications approved for that EIDL loan and grant when they had applied and they were stalled. They had applied for the application. 
They were not approved. They were stalled up. They were locked in what I call the 330, 331, the 484 tax. But on air, off air, I went over how to get their applications approved one at a time. They followed my advice and they got them approved. $25 million of EID loans approved, saving their homes, their businesses, and their employees' homes. Then, three days later, PUA was going live. I didn't do their applications for them. I showed them how to fix issues, how to do the application overall, how to answer certain questions, what the questions answer. Then they slowly got every single one of them approved. $15,000 for Eileen Bellicamp out of Florida. But then in fall of 2020, there was no second stimulus checks coming. So I showed people how to get big money from rent and utilities and viewers got $250,000 to this channel. Like Tyrone, his family of four got $15,000. He picked up the phone, he got money and rent in Boston. And now we're doing it bigger and bolder than ever before. So yes, again, pick up the pen and paper because today is your day for you to get these big sums of money. You're getting the money. You're not having the community page do it for you as like an indentured slave. That's not who they are. You're picking up the phone and getting this money because you can do it and I have confidence in you. Are you ready? I'm going to show you six places to reach out to first. Those six places have different eligibility. So if one says no, reach out to the next one. It's all six you need to reach out to. Don't just reach out to one, not the other six. Number two, it's important to understand that every place has different eligibility and different pots of money, so keep on pushing. Number three, it's important to remember that there's lots of money, and every state was given the same amount of money based upon the number of residents in that state. And finally, I say the keywords I tell viewers on this channel, you're going to hear those keywords. It really helps them get it approved. Here you go. These are the six places you reach out to. Your city hall, your city house authority. Your county hall, your county house authority. Your state hall and your state house authority. The keywords you can say are rent assistance because of COVID. Rent or mortgage or utility assistance because of COVID. Uh, and you don't say words they don't know, like stimulus or Mitch's wonderful personality. <clears throat> Those are the six places you reach out to. You reach out to all six places. You know where your city is. You know where your county is. You know where your state is. You reach out to all six places. You do not reach out to the volunteers unless you've reached out to all six places and gone through one of them. I had one video yesterday say I reached out to one of the six and the phone didn't answer. So now I'm going to the volunteers. Uh, no. <laughs> you reach out to all six. The phone didn't answer? Okay, well then call again. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is not... Um, uh... <laughs> <laughs> this is not the telephone company. And there we go. Congratulations, Tim, Tim and Linda, who got this wonderful bottle of money. The next bottle of money, if you got this money for rent or utilities, post in the live chat right now. The next bottle of money is the money for SNAP. SNAP is money for food, and it is a SNAP. Eligibility is easier than a stimulus check. Where do you get it? Department of Agriculture. It pays for food. How much does it pay? A lot. Lynn Glenn got it for herself, her son, and her mom. And how much does it pay? A fortune. A family of four out of Hawaii gets upwards of $16,000 a year. Mark got $19,000, but guess what? Mark is now sitting on 25000 <gasps> What happened? Department of Agriculture two weeks ago raised everyone's benefits up an average of 25% lifetime nationwide automatically starting October. And congratulations to Tim and Linda, who, who uh, Lynn Glenn, who got for herself, her son, a mom, and Gail got as well. If you got the money for SNAP, post in the live chat right now. The next pot of the money is the refund check coming back from your state due to overpayment computer error. This is where the computers were not working. <laughs> <laughs> Windows 10? No, Windows 1910. Uh, and they just weren't upgrading. So now the federal government has ordered the states to return that money back to you. One viewer got 3000 another viewer got 5000 Reach out to your state to get that money. And the last part of the money is the refund check coming back from IRS that you pay taxes on that 2020 unemployment benefits. Margaret got it, Cog got it, Michael got it. The average payment is anywhere from 1100 all the way up to $2,000. More about that second, but here's a personal message for me to you. This channel was launched for me to help other people. And the spirit of this channel is me helping you and you helping others. So if you're on the live chat, please post your success stories for any money you've gotten for rent, utilities, food, or internet. Yesterday, someone did this. She said, I was getting $15 a month for Snap. Now I'm getting $350 a month for Snap. I love that. That's just a wonderfully inspiring story. Post your success story in the live chat because when you do, you inspire people because guess what? You need to pick up the phone. You need to pick up the phone today. You need to be calling all six places at least to start. You need to be, be picking up the phone and getting these sums of money because this money is available right now. Four stimulus checks are not available this week. This money is available this week. Pick up the phone. Get that inspiration for those people. These sums of money are going bigger and bolder. $27,000 for rent. You can do this. I have confidence of you, in you. Then people are getting multiple items. You need to be getting every single last item you can get 
under third stimulus. If you got one, don't stop. Keep on pushing. Art Sullivan and Nisi inspired us by getting three items. And finally, understand the numbers are going bigger and bolder than ever before. And with that, let's cut back to those unemployed benefits. Where are they landing? Direct deposit otherwise in the mail. Can we track them? Yeah, 70% of the time we can. Go to irs.gov and do a transcript search and reveal the tax return you filed, the taxes you paid, and the refund check you're getting. And can we top that? Yes, as we go into the second half of this video starting right now. Deal done, signed, sealed. A $3.5 trillion recon is a done deal. It means that we'll be seeing the biggest recon in the history of this channel. And it's called the Four Stimulus Recon. Price tag $3.5 trillion. T all checks for the American people. Previous stimulus packages were all for corporations. This one's all for the American people. And this one is a behemoth. How do we get to this wonderful spot? And what are these checks? And how do they work? And what are the details? I'm going to go over a lot more about these checks in the final 15 minutes of this video. Stay to then. But let's go over how they got to the spot. By taking roads and bridges out of the recon, the overall price tag of the recon was too big. And the harder, the larger was the harder it was to pass. By allowing the Democrats to take out some of the spending from the bipartisan, from the recon, roads and bridges, and put in the bipartisan, the overall price tag of the recon got smaller. In other words, the bipartisan deal made the recon passable. Where are they on this process? Well, let's back up. In the month of June and July, I had told you that the recon was going to pass because they had met amongst themselves, the Democratic Caucus, House, and Senate with the President, and agreed upon a recon, doing a recon and doing one that's a $3.5 trillion. So that when they wrote it to a bill, it confirmed their oral agreement, and then when they called it for a, called it for a vote, it passed in the blink of an eye. It's important to understand that this is how Democrats do legislation with other Democrats. This recon is only Democrats with Democrats. That was recon procedural. Now they're on recon substantive. The way they're doing recon substantive, the same way. Going to meet the friend, the colleague, the fellow senator down the hall, having lunch, having coffee, saying, what do you think about this? Coming to a verbal agreement eventually and getting that verbal agreement then reduced to a writing, a bill, which confirms the verbal agreement, and then calling for a vote. It's all dependent upon the verbal agreement. So no time and place to say, um, let me just wait for the bill. No, the verbal agreement is what makes the deal. The verbal agreement is the deal because it's Democrats or Democrats. There's no Republicans involved. All the senators are in town. All the senators are in town. All weekend long, all week long last week and all this week, I've been reporting the same update from Ron White and Ron Klan, the president's chief of staff, Bernie and Chuck, which is they're speaking about four to five times per day on these provisions of the recon. And those recon provisions are what they're coming to a verbal agreement upon. Once they'd agreed upon that price tag of $3.5 trillion, it was smooth sealing. And that's why they had demanded a large enough recon. That's why Representative Rishi Torres, a Democrat, Elon Omar, both Democrats, both progressives, had said before they agreed upon the price tag, we need a big recon. And they got it. And that's why once everyone got a big recon, the president said, protect my recon, because everything in that recon is all progressive priorities. The White House's priorities, says Jalapal and Brian Schatz. So what is a recon? What is a bipartisan? What is a recon procedure? And what's a recon substantive? Let's go over all the details right now and understand where we are. Number one, they've passed the recon procedural. Number two, they're on the recon substantive. They were working all last weekend. They worked all this week. And if you hear otherwise, as in fact one Purple Power member wanted to say over and over in the live chat this morning and got banned for a bit that senators are out of town, they're not working, they're not doing anything, they're not working. Untrue, untrue, untrue. The only people who tell you that? <laughs> Conservative media. Yeah, untrue. And they're in town, they're working, and they're going over the legislative process. So it's important to understand that this is the time and place to push Purple Power. Let's go over what a recon is, what a bipartisan is, and separate out then to recon procedural versus recon substantive. A recon and bipartisan. So recon is your money, also called reconciliation, also called budget bill, also called the Democratic spending plan, price tag $3.5 trillion. Also called the Democratic Social Reform Plan or the Progressive Social Reform Plan. Bipartisan, not your money. Roads and bridges, also called infrastructure. We have three bills to do, and guess what? We got the first one done. That is recon procedural. The tow truck has first passed over the finish line. Now time to pick up the tow hitch. The tow hitch is the recon substantive. Let's go over what recon substantive versus procedural involves and what they're doing right now. So recon procedural is a price tag of $3.5 trillion. 
and that price tag of $3.5 trillion agreed to, and that the committees are given certain amounts of money. Those certain amount of monies are for you. Watch that word committees. I'm going to come back to it in the final 15 minutes of the video. How the committees spend the money is now what they're doing right now. Right now, they're coming to a verbal agreement on the recon substantive. That verbal agreement is basically the finish line. The verbal agreement is the finish line. Once they have that verbal agreement, then they put it to bill format, which confirms the verbal agreement, and then they vote a ceremonial vote because they've already agreed upon it, and then we're done. Very, very important time horizon right now, which is why it's important to push Purple Power because this is right where the toe hitch is really trying to get right over the finish line, the verbal agreement on the recon substantive. How do we get to this wonderful spot? From Jalapal, who recently wrote Schumer letters saying Chuck called the vote on the recon. The letter is signed by 12 House Democrats, part of 100 plus House Democrats, who recently said they're going to be giving you monthly stimulus checks. Understand that the summer, the, 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 uh, the month of September of 2021 is just like September 2020. When conservative media wants to run fake facts, have you met Frida? <laughs> she loves fake facts. Here she is. She's freedom of speech Frida. Freedom of speech Frida is all about faux facts. She just walks into the supermarket with a wad of cash and says, do you know that um, Mitt Romney invented... Uh, Santa Claus? <laughs> Do you know that Mitch McConnell invented Christmas? Yeah, she has fake facts all over the place. And what is one of the fake facts? Um, that no one of the Democrats are in town. <laughs> yeah, fake fact. Uh, that no one of the Democrats, that no one's talking about stimulus checks. No, it's the Republicans who are talking about stimulus checks. All the Democrats are talking about stimulus checks. So let's go over some of those Democrats that are talking about stimulus checks and why it's important to keep them talking about them. We have uh, House Ways and Means Committee, which we're, can we top that? Yes, House Ways and Means Committee. Ryan, the president, and I are saying they're going to be putting a forced stimulus check in the forced stimulus package. We have the House bill calling a thousand dollars, calling for a thousand dollars a month after the first month pandemic plus one year. We have AOC and Omar calling for two thousand dollars a month, and of course we have Warren Sanders and Wyden, among countless others, and the hundred plus calling for a monthly stimulus check. Everyone's talking about it. Can we top that? Yes. As we go into the final 15 minutes of this video, we'll go over the world exclusive about those monthly stimulus checks, MSCs, and the push to get them in there. We'll be going over the breaking news today about what Janet Yellen said about this whole entire process, and we can compare that against Ron Klain's comments, the chief of staff from last weekend. And then we'll be cutting to fist stimulus as well. But first, here is, uh, but first, can we top that? Yes. It's important to understand that in the monies that are available right now, there's no forced stimulus check line in this week. The eviction moratorium over. The mortgage, the extension of enhanced unemployment benefits on a federal and state level over. A lot of things are ending. But what's not ending is third stimulus. Lots of money for you to get. Now, understand, when I launched the community page in 2020, it was to help people who have attempted to try to get the money using all the resources, using all the information should I deliver you on a video, and if they can't, then reach out to the community page. But in recent weeks, it's become the reverse, and that's not acceptable. The community page is for people who have used, have reached out to all six places. City Hall, City House Authority. County Hall, County House Authority. State Hall, State House Authority. You've gone through the whole process with all six of them. You can't seem to get something approved. You've reached out to Department of Agriculture for SNAP. You've reached out for the utility companies for water, electric, gas, now it seems as though, unfortunately, as an update from the volunteers, that some people are doing literally nothing and reach out to the volunteers saying, I want $80,000 like Johnny got. Uh, no, no, no. That is not what the community page is. Do not do that or I will yank the community page right off this channel. The community page is not for you to just simply say, hi, can you just give me free money? There's a tree in your backyard. Can you pick some money off the tree? No, no, no. The community page is after you make the effort to try to get the money. Then you reach out to them. And I don't want to hear something like, I don't know where my city hall is. Uh, there's the inform there's the phone book. <laughs> there is Google. There is picking up the phone and talking into your phone saying, can you call city hall? Everyone can find where their city hall is, and you're not going to stop at city hall. City hall, city house authority, number two. County hall, county house authority, number four. State hall, state house authority, number six. You're going to do those moves. You're going to pick up the phone and call the utility, water, gas, electric, and you're going to get those sums of money as well. Then if you can't get all of them, 
or if you can't get past the first, then you can reach out to the volunteers and community page to help them get you. I encourage the volunteers as well to ask people when they're reaching out to them, did you reach out to the six places mentioned on this channel? And what happened before engaging in the conversation? And here's a little bit about the community page. And I'll be back with you in 60 seconds as we heat up with the final 15 minutes of Afternoons Allied. If you want money right now, not five days from now, and not five weeks from now, then reach out to the community page. The volunteers can help you find that money for rent and utilities. That's at news.la.com forward slash community. The community page features a series of volunteers who are viewers like you. They can help you find rent, utilities, SNAP, food benefits, mortgage assistance, and help you with eviction moratorium questions as well. Their Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram individuals reach out to them and indicate the city and state you're from, and they'll get back to you shortly. That's a community page. Volunteers working for you, viewers helping one another. Stay with LA for more. Join LA Late Daily for the excitement of the new LA Late Live Daily. The excitement starts on mornings LA Late at 9 a.m. LA Late returns at 11 a.m. daily. And then afternoons LA Late at 1 p.m. Join us daily as the excitement continues live from Santa Monica on LA Late. And the excitement continues right now on Afternoons LA, direct from Santa Monica, where the weather is beautiful today, but a little bit muggy. <laughs> Hope the weather is good where you are. Jump in the live chat and tell me where you're tuning in from and how the weather is. In the final 15 minutes of this video, we'll go over the breaking news as Janet Yellen speaks out about September and all these legislative paths that have to be gotten. Then we'll cut to those MSCs, monthly stimulus checks, and the number one guy in D.C. in a world exclusive what he wants to give you. Then we'll be going to cutting to application-based stimulus. And I'm already seeing your tweets on Twitter. I love them. I'll be going over some of those tweets and what some of your comments are as well. And then we'll be cutting back over to this stimulus because guess what? SSI and SSDI deserve it. And I go over all the incredible details of that and more. And with that, subscribe. 400,000 subscribers on YouTube record. I want you part of this family. Hit that subscribe button right now. Like the video too. 30,000 likes and consider becoming a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power, or Calcino VIP. The link is on the video and in the pinned comment. Meantime, if you haven't signed up for those LA alerts, please do so. Let's cut to fist stimulus because guess what? This is very important. There's always someone who wants to jump in the comments and say, why are we talking about fist stimulus when we haven't done four stimulus? Because fist stimulus is about SSI, SSDI, and Social Security reform, more so than just your stimulus check. And this is what was promised a long time ago, over a year ago on the campaign trail. How does this work? Well, step one is they're going to raise your benefits up if you're on SSI, SSDI, Social Security Railroad Benefits. Then they're going to apply a new benchmark. That new benchmark is inflation. And that new benchmark of inflation is going up. The Central Bank of Europe is meeting this week to deal with the issue of inflation overseas. World inflation is a big issue. And they're still trying to figure about it, figure out how to deal with it here. How high are they looking at it? I'm saying about 5%. Let's go over the analysis. First, they'll raise your benefits up a lifetime, but then they'll apply a new benchmark. And that benchmark is 5%. That means you'll go up another 5%. Not just next year, but lifetime. Because once your benefits go up, they never go down. They're going to move the asset cap, get rid of the income cap, and get rid of the marriage penalty. And love is going to win, and marriage will <laughs> conquer all, and your benefits will be restored. Meantime, will there be a fiscal stimulus check? Yeah, the House Ways and Means Committee will represent them, give you one as well. And finally, if you haven't become a Purple Hawk member, what are you doing? The link is under the video. Purple Hawks are delivered daily from me to them, a breakdown of all the big money available under first, second, and third stimulus. This is a lot of money. A lot of money. And that's how Purple Hawks are being able by themselves to pick up the phone and get these sums of money. When third stimulus passed, I launched Purple Hawks in January of this year. Because it was a fourteen dollars stimulus check, I said sure, but I can get you fourteen thousand dollars from this package—a lot of money. Now viewers are getting upwards of fifty, eighty, 
hundred thousand dollars from fourth stimulus as well third stimulus as well so pick up that so go to the under the video and become a member purple hawk purple power castle you know vip and get delivered to you daily a breakdown of all this big money for you to get and with that we go into the final 15 minutes of this video starting right now deal done signed sealed your fourth stimulus recon is a done deal now what did janet yellen say this morning about all this stuff and what did ron clay and chief of staff of the president say last weekend we got a lot of stuff to do <laughs> what did ron wyden say last week we got a lot of stuff to do it's important to understand because i've seen this before and we've done this before that when there's a lot of legislation that has to be done at the same time and you look at it sometimes it looks like something else and you're wondering which one is my bell <laughs> it's sort of like a horse race which one is my horse i can't tell which one is my bell Janet Yellen this morning was talking about this debt ceiling limit, which has to be taken care of in September. It's about to expire. If it doesn't get taken care of, the U.S. government goes to default and that our U.S. credit rating goes down. Yeah, just, some, just little minor things out there. She says you need to take care of that. Uh, and she wants bipartisan support for it. Oh, yeah, great. Uh, so wonderful, wonderful, wonderful letter. Um, add that to the list of like a thousand things that have to get, get, get done in September. Now, I don't bring this up to say to you um, they're not going to take care of our stuff because they got other stuff to do it. I just want to say there's a lot of stuff out there. And you may see them talking about one thing and say, that's ours or is it not ours? Because a lot of the words sometimes sound the same. Let's turn to the recon. One of the common questions I hear from people is, well, if the recon is passed, why haven't they sent out the money? Because they got to do the recon substance. The recon substance is that verbal agreement they have to go warm to room and say, hey, what are we going to do now that the money's dedicated to the committee? How is the committee going to spend the money? And they have to come to that verbal agreement. When they have that verbal agreement done, then we're done. The tow truck is over the finish line. Then they put it to a bill and they call it for a vote and we're done really quickly. The recon will be enormous. It'll be $3.5 trillion, and it will all be for checks to the American people. What does this mean for application-based checks, and how does that differ from IRS sent out checks? IRS sent out checks on getting two in one second. But first, let me go over these application-based. It means you pick up the phone and get the money. It does not mean you hold out your hand and wait and jump in the comments, what day is in my direct deposit account? Never. It will never be in your direct deposit account automatically because they don't know that they have to pay you this money. Uh, on Twitter this morning, someone said, I love when you talk about the dental. I really like that. How do I apply for that? That is the focus. That is a wonderful comment. It makes me so excited when I see that. It's someone who's ready to pounce and get the sums of money. Application base we've been doing since day one, where you pick up the phone and say, hi, I want this money. They don't know you want the money unless you ask for it. And let's look at some of these items because guess what? IRS would never know to pay these items because it doesn't do with the, deal with these type of items. There are items like free school meals for all checks, tax break checks, cheaper prescription medication checks, checks for free internet, checks for farmers, checks for independent contractors, checks for workers, checks for uh, seniors, checks for lowering the eligibility age for Medicare, checks for dental, checks for vision, and checks for hearing care. IRS Treasury I can't send out a check to you for your dental. They don't know anything about your teeth. And that's why early in this video where I showed you that gra those two graphics, recon procedure and recon substance, where we're talking about committees, that's where the money will be. The committees will have the money. A committee for the dental, a committee for the vision, a committee for different items. This is what we've been doing since day one, application-based stimulus, where you pick up the phone and say, hi, I want to get that money for food because my kids had to stay home from school. I want to get that money for my husband and I, PBT. This is application-based stimulus. You've been doing it since day one where you pick up the phone. When we look at that graphic, how the committee spend the money, that is where the money will be. You'll pick up the phone and say, hi, committee, I want this money. I'm going to show you how to get this money. It's going to be a lot. The reason why Purple Hawks are going to do really well on the, under this is because Purple Hawks have now been trained, acclimated, acclimated uh, educated, informed on these videos. And you've done it to pick up the phone and get sums of money since second stimulus. You've been doing since second stimulus. You're doing a lot right now in the third stimulus, and you're going to kill it on the fourth stimulus. Johnny picked up the phone and got seven items. He got $80,000. He picked up the phone and called seven different places. That's why early in this video, I was a little tough on, <laughs> unfortunately, I think I was a little too tough, but I was a little tough when I said, stop just reaching out to the community page, say, hi, can you go pick some cash off the tree in the backyard for me? No, no, no. You need to pick up the phone and call the six places. You need to call the six places. Because if you don't do that, number one, you're misusing the purpose of the community page. But number two, 
when forced stimulus happens, you won't know what's going to hit you because you'll say, wait a second, dental, I want that money. Hey, community page, can you go get me the dental? No, no, no. They're not going to do that for you. We're not going to do that for you. The purpose of the community page is to help you when you can't find stuff. But when I say to you, dental is at this committee, go get it. No. You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of the early days of May 2020. I did have some people back then said, hey, can you fill out an EIDL application for me? Absolutely not. I'm not filling out an EIDL application for you. You can do it yourself. I'll tell you what's wrong if you get into questions or I'll answer your questions on, on the certain line items and what they need to do. I'm not filling out an application for you. This is not what I do here. This is not what anyone does for you. You need to get this money because this money is yours. You're going to kill it. You're going to rock it. And then people say, hey, what did you do? Just like Johnny's neighbors said, a friend and family said, what did you do? Okay, I'm going to pick up the phone. Johnny didn't do the application for the friend and family. They did it and they got 100000 That's where the big money is. Now, let's turn to the MSE, monthly stimulus check. Let's go over the monthly stimulus check. It's important to understand that the monthly stimulus check, MSE, has been talked about by a lot of Democrats. In fact, there's virtually no Democrat who hasn't talked about it, whether it's AOC or the, or the Ways and Means Committee or Warren, Wyden, and Sanders. But when you talk about the recon bill, the actual real name of it is the Fourth Stimulus Reconciliation Budget Bill. What's the number one committee for the budget bill? The budget committee. Yeah, the budget committee goes over the budget bill. And who's the head of the budget committee? The budget chairman. Oh, yeah, that's so obvious. Budget chairman, the budget bill, and the budget committee. And who's the chairman of the budget committee? Bernie Budget Sanders. Oh, I know him. Yeah, yeah. So he's the number one guy for the budget bill. Oh, okay. So what is going on with the broadcast media? They're just doing no reporting. What are they doing? They're using search engines as their search, as their sources of reporting. That's not sources. Uh, the way you get a source on whether there's a monthly stimulus check is to pick up the phone and ask AOC or ask Warren or Wyden or Sanders or Bernie. And they're not doing that. We're doing it. And this is the word exclusive. I had viewers two weeks ago, actually three weeks ago, pick up the phone, and I said to them, pick up the phone, call your Democratic senator, and ask them whether they're giving you a monthly stimulus check, and and, uh, and tell them the importance of giving them a monthly stimulus check. And they did. Uh, WR picked up the phone and called Senator Chris Coons, Democrat, Delaware, Joe Biden's old confidant, and said professionally, respectfully, and kindly, I need a monthly stimulus check. I need a monthly stimulus check. And the response was, well, Senator Chris Coons is putting it in there. There you go. Wow. Now, understand why I paused and I corrected myself in that last sentence is because the way Purple Power works is we tell people what we need. We don't ask things. We don't say something because I, I, you heard how it came out of my mouth. I was initially saying WR asked and I corrected. I said, no, WR said. That's important. You don't call up legislators saying, hi, are you giving me money? No, you don't say that. You pick them up the phone and say, hi, I want to tell you um, the importance of why I need you to do this type of legislation for me so I get the money. That's how you, you, you basically say to them what you believe, your advocacy, economic, social, economic advocacy. You advocate for what you need. So what happened? Well, two weeks ago, Bernie Sanders appeared uh, in a print article on the record and said, I'm different than prior budget chairmen. Prior budget chairmen do everything within D.C., and I like to get out amongst the people and hear from them. <laughs> I immediately said translation. He wants to hear from you. He wants to hear from you what to put in the budget bill. So I said two weeks ago, pick up the phone, call Senator Bernie Sanders professionally, respectfully, and kindly, and say why it's important for a monthly stimulus check. Don't call up and ask for tracking. <laughs> do not. Do not be Wendy Colleen or Cod, <laughs> you know who they are. You know what a calendar Colleen would say. When, it's September, Bernie, it's September. No, you don't do that. Or calendar Cod would say, Elizabeth, whatever happened to September? What happened to July? Uh, Ron, whatever happened to August? You don't do that either. And you don't be Wendy or Will when. When? <laughs> Hello, uh, this is Senator's office. When? <laughs> do you have a comment? No, I just want to say, when? <laughs> you don't, just don't do that. You say what you need. And that's what Lynn Glenn did. She picked up the phone, called Bernie Sanders' office, and the importance of a stimulus check. And then Brother Joshua, a longtime viewer of this channel, purple uh, longtime viewer and a 2020 volunteer, picked up the phone professionally, respectfully, and kindly spoke to Senator Bernie Sanders' staffer and said of the need for a monthly stimulus check. I would talk to you about the need for a monthly stimulus check. The staffer immediately came back and said, yes, Senator Sanders is already proposing one on the fourth stimulus package. <gasps> World exclusive. World exclusive. Had the broadcast media picked up the phone and actually asked someone, then you would have had the answer. 
Bernie Sanders staffer says, yes, we want to. Mr. Senator Bernie Sanders wants to give you a multi-stimulus check, but he needs to have the support of the American people on this. Purple power, this is all your thing. Let's go over the deal provisions, uh, the items that were discussed in that conversation. The staffer told Senator, uh, told uh, Brother Joshua these were the proposed items that Bernie is working on. First, $1,000 to $1,400 a monthly stimulus check. Yes, great news. And second, a monthly stimulus check. Yes, great news. And number three, a duration of three to six months. Oh, awesome, great news. The House bill is 12 months, but it was only $1,000 a month after the first month. So that would take you 12 months to get $13,000. This on the high end, at the high end, would take you six months to get $9,000. This is a very good deal, very good deal. So that conversation with Bernie, with Bernie Sanders, Saffer will continue with the Saffer saying, but Senator Sanders only wants to do it if he sees the support from the American people. You got this, Purple Power. We got this. What's Purple Power? Purple Power is the community launched by me, created by me in 2020. People are calling me Mr. Purple because I was wearing a lot of purple outside. And when I was doing EIDL, I said, hey, you have the power. You have the purple power. You can get the stuff done yourself as well. I'm giving you the purple power so you can do it as well. Then uh, in the weeks that came, when Second Simulus was not getting done because the Heroes Act was falling apart, I said, we need to push purple power. We need to push and get them to get those stimulus checks done. And we made history in 2020 when this channel when me, when I came up with the idea of putting a stimulus check in the continuing resolution in fall 2020, an absurd idea I was told at the time, I said, I don't care. I know it doesn't belong in there. We're going to push to get it in there. And we did. You and I together made history. Now it's our time again to make history because the number one guy on the budget bill with the budget bill wants you to have his back to push to put a stimulus check in there. Pick up the phone, be respectful, be kind, polite, call up Warren, Wyden, Sanders, AOC, Omar, all these people and say, you have my back. I need, we need a monthly stimulus check in there. Do it. Get it done. Incredible. Great news. Now, what did Ron Wyden, what did Ron Clay in, the president's chief of staff, what did uh, Jan Yellen, and what are all these people collectively saying? They're doing a lot of stuff. They're doing a lot of stuff right now. They are in town working their butts off on so many pieces of different legislation. That's the truth. The fake facts from Frida is that Democrats are out of town. They don't care. They're in the South Pacific sipping a Mai Tai, driving around in Bentleys. Just, just not true. Not true. So please, this is the time and place to push. This is the time and place to push. Finally, uh, I'm very excited about Sanders' approach to the situation, um, but I also want you to understand that September gets more busy as we go along, so push stronger right now. And with that, so much happening across the board. Coming up next is Overnight's Crypto, and also afternoons, and also evenings at LA at 5 o'clock. Then we go Industry and Stimulus at 6, and then uh, 7, and then Sir Lloyd is back at 8 o'clock. So with that, subscribe. 400,000 subscribers on YouTube record. I want you part of this family. Hit that subscribe button right now. Like the video, 2, 3,000 likes, and consider becoming a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power, Calcino VIP. Stay informed, stay focused, have a beautiful afternoon, and stay with LA for more.